What's up, Internet? Hey, guys. Today, I'm going to do something I've never done. I'm going to follow a recipe that I saw on TikTok. You know that app that all us uh, millennials are using? Are we a millennial? We are millennials. Is that what we're called? We're on the cusp. We're on the cusp? Yeah. All right, yeah. Millennials are on TikTok, too, apparently. So, um, I saw this TikTok from someone named Mandy Lee Mitchell. It's basically chicken baked in the oven and you powder buttermilk ranch seasoning powder. You put pepperoncinis on it, you put some cheese on it, you you put it in the oven and it's supposed to be fantabulous. Sound great to you, Pamela? Rico me encanta. Yes. What was that? Slather on the love. Oh yeah, you gotta get that love on there. But before you, before you do, <laughs> before you do any of it, take your wedding ring off. If you have one. Give it to someone you care about. Hopefully the person you're married to. <laughs> wash them hands, you nasty bugs. Wash your hands, wash your hands, you dirty rascal, you dirty rascal. Get them nothing clean, get them nothing clean. You dirty rascal, you dirty rascal. Checking out that white boy booty. <laughs> You thought I was gonna do it? I knew you would. I like chicken. I like pepperoncinis, aka banana peppers. I like ranch. Put them together. What do you got? Bibbidi bobbidi. Hopefully mm. it's. Mmm. Bibbidi bobbidi. Mmm. Mm. Let's get the chicken. Uh, since there are three of us eating in this house, the direction said for four. I'm gonna do for three. I'm gonna get three of these breastuses out and put them in a. What do you call this, babe? Pyrex. A what? Pyrex. Pyrex? Yeah, they're called Pyrex. Dish. Like a pie rack? Rex. Rex? Like the brand of those types of dishes are Pyrex. Oh, I just thought it was like a baking dish? Yeah, same. Pyrex sounds more professional. You're a better cook than me, so I'm gonna go with how you describe things. Spray it down. This is supposed to be super easy, by the way. Barely an inconvenience. Who am I referencing from YouTube? Get it nice and sprayed. I went to the grocery store and I picked up ranch salad dressing seasoning mix. Now she used buttermilk ranch because she said it was low in carbs. I, I'm just gonna go with it because this is all I could find. Am I supposed to rinse the chicken? Ooh la la. Are you supposed to pat it dry? Nah. <laughs> Maybe. I think you are, you know the, con I can already, I know what the comments are gonna say. Always pat your meat dry, no pun intended there. Always pat your meat dry so that the seasoning can, get, can be applied correctly. I'm gonna repeat this process a few times. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees. I'm gonna put all this stuff down below as well. Again, I didn't come up with this. It was from her name. I'm putting her name here. Go follow her on TikTok. She has a lot of cool cooking videos. Man places in the kitchen. That's what a man should be. <laughs> cooking for his family. I'm becoming a decent cook. Can we just start with that? Right. I don't want them to have high expectations of me. You know Josh, completely adequate. Mm -hmm. Also, if you're dealing with a chicken breast that has any of this kind of excess, you see that? <laughs> Feel free to trim that off. Yeah, so just clean it up place it in your Pyrex. Now let me go back to the directions. Here's another super simple chicken dinner that our family loves. You're gonna take four chicken breasts and this time two packets of ranch dressing mix. I use the buttermilk because it has zero carbs. Well, I guess the non-buttermilk, we gonna have some carbs in there. <laughs> Sprinkle dinkle. Oh my gosh, that's a lot, babe. Maybe I should've only cut one open. I think that's, that's plenty. Plus she uses it for four and I'm doing three. She used mozzarella. Cheese. I'm not gonna use mozzarella. You know why? Cause... We don't have mozzarella. Well, oh, I specifically I got queso cheese. Also pronounced? Queso? Si. Really, it's, it's just to your taste. Whatever you like. All over the chicken. Look at that, oh yes. See that? See, Bobby Flay. I'm coming for you, Bobby Flay. <laughs> Actually, I'm not because Bobby Flay is an incredible cook. I used to, I'll be straight up about, here's the tea on Bobby Flay. As a kid watching his content, because Bobby Flay has been around for a while. As a kid, I was always kind of afraid of Bobby Flay. <laughs> I was like, oh, he seems like a bully. 
If I went to school with him and we were the same age, I bet Bobby Flay would have picked on me. I remember thinking that as like a 13, 14 year old. Uh, but now that I'm watching him as an, an adult, he's just confident, right? Mm -hmm. I, I, I really like Bobby Flay. That's why he's a good cook. Bobby Flay does it with gusto. Oven is still preheating. We're at 235. You want that to get up to 350. Then it says, then drain an entire jar of pepperoncini peppers. Cover the chicken with the peppers. Did you hear that, folks? Basically, banana peppers. I love banana peppers. Anytime I go to Subway, I like to have banana peppers on my sandwiches. Mm. I've never had it just on chicken breast straight up like that, but we're gonna do that. So I picked up, for this household, I went with mild. Mild banana pepper rings. She said to dump the whole thing. That's what we're gonna do. I have no idea if this is gonna taste great or not, but you gotta try things. So many things growing up, I never wanted to try it because it looked weird or it sounded gre weird, <laughs> weird. <laughs> but then later in life, I was like, wow, why did I, it take me like 10 years to try that? She said drain the whole thing, juice and all. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of juice. Let's just go for it. Again, confidence, right? Mm -hmm. Confidence, I'm just doing it. I just did it, look at that. I'm gonna listen to my gut. My gut says that there's too much juice in that. Okay. Okay. I'm going to drain just enough where I feel comfortable. What does she say next, my love? I think this is the part that kind of scared Pamela because you know we're trying to eat healthier. I thought she said do a dance. Oh, she, she said do a dance? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> when I showed this video to Pamela, I think the part that really scared her was add a little bit extra cheese on top. That. She's like, that's a lot of cheese, babe. It is a lot. I do love cheese. Yeah, but when we're trying to be a little conscious of what we're doing and what we're eating, I mean, you kind of want to do everything with balance, right? Don't be excessive with things. I think this needs more cheese. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it does. So I'm gonna do that. There's cheese on the floor, that's okay. The dogs love to eat the cheese. We are almost at 350, so anything you have left, I guess this is the time to clean up your workstation. Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, everybody do your... Cheater. Do you believe in my fucking love? You get it? Because I said, do your, sh do your share. I had a dream that I was a share impersonator the other night. Really? Is it because your mom wants us to be the modern day Sonny and Cher? Maybe. Yeah. The oven is now ready to go at 350. Now, the lovely, I keep forgetting her name, please forgive me. Mandy Lee or Lay, L-E-I-G-H. Mandy Lee. Probably Lee. Mandy Lee Mitchell. That's a nice name. Pop this in the oven at 350 for 45 minutes or until we... All right, so 350 for 45 minutes. That's what it looks like before. Shout out to Mandy Lee Mitchell. Get all the way up in there. Get in that grill. Show it. Ooh, ooh, Pamela's a camera woman. Pamela and Pamela. Pamela. Pamela and camera. I love you so much. You're on camera vision. Yeah. Place it in the middle of the rack there. Goodbye. Shh. Look at that. Okay, ladies and germs. We are now going to set a timer for four. 40 minutes or 45? She said, she said 40 or 45 or until it looks ready. Hey Siri, set a timer 45. for 40 minutes, yeah. please. Your timer is set for 40 minutes. Didn't she say in this part, you just do a really cool whistle song? <laughs> whistle while you twerk. Go ahead and start it. Make the honey fart and whistle while you twerk. Why do you guys watch me? All right, so I guess I'll see you guys in about 40-ish minutes to reveal the whole thing. I'm gonna prepare a few side items. That's not part of this video. I think we're gonna do some sauteed kale, throwing it back with some uh, mushrooms in there, maybe a salad on the side. But I will see you guys, not in 40 minutes, we're gonna speed that up. So in three, two, three, two, one. <laughs> it's been 40-ish minutes. Pamela, can I have my ring back? Mm-hmm.
A million times yes. No, he wouldn't. Come get a shot of this. See that? It looks like a success, but that's just visually. Uh, I'm gonna plate these, we're gonna take a bite, we'll let you know if we like it and if we recommend it. I'm sure we're gonna love it. Uh, so I'll see you again in just a moment. I'm not gonna do a countdown because apparently I can't count to three or from three. We're supposed to do the MC Hammer dance. Oh, 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 oh. He's gonna round them shoulders. Oh, 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 oh right? And then hips. There you go, there you go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Come on, man. Dance has been dance. This is the plate. See? Salad and then uh, sauteed kale with mushrooms. But this is the star of the show. I'll let you know if it's good or not. Bon appetit. Mmm, delicious. I'm going to eat you. Do you like it? What's, what's the, the verdict? It's delicious. You like it, yum yum? Absolutely delicious. Hooray! I gotta get a bite of this and a bite of that. Really good. For real? You can be honest. I promise. What do you like about it? It's juicy, a little tart, a little crunch to it, creamy, mm -hmm. amazing. Hooray! Mm -hmm. Alright, so I cut mine all off. Oh my gosh, you have to taste it. Before we sit down and watch The Office, that's what we do every night, I'll take a bite. So excited. Mm -hmm. Give it a smile. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Everything Pamela said. I have nothing to add because she articulated it well. Hey, it's simple, it's easy. Try it yourself and let me know if there's another TikTok recipe that we should try, put it in the comment section below. And I will see you guys next time. Enjoy your day, evening, night, and whatever meal you are going to have. Forthcom forthcoming? Sure. Next. Be nice to yourselves, be nice to people worldwide.